there, Flawed and Fabulous and Casper too. This is my first live stream. I'm really just practicing. I didn't know how the quality would come out on my laptop. This is the only way that I can do it um, right now because I haven't reached the 1,000 subscribers. But I really need watch time. And I thought that, you know, this was helping me network. So maybe I could help others network and get some watch hours and hit my 1,000 at the same time. So, hey, Jesse James. Glad to see you. That was so nice of you to stop by. Oh, look at this. I didn't think anybody would come. I was so nervous. So I don't really have any, like, great super content, but I've watched another uh, enough of them. I, I guess I just, I like the personal touch. I have been enjoying, like, seeing everybody on lives, and I have met such great friends. I have only, sound is not that great. I got, I do have a mic that I bought, but I tried to set it up and it didn't work. I'm going to try to talk really loud. <laughs> I have a, oh, my dogs are fighting. Y'all stop, stop, stop playing. You're making too much noise. I'll try to basically yell at the computer to try it tonight. I have a um, microphone coming in on, on Monday. So this is basically just trial and error. You can hear me good with earbuds. Oh, good. I just, um, I guess I'm trying. I, oh, you can't hear me yelling. <laughs> I'm so nervous, but I'm so excited. So I am loving YouTube. I am, just for those who don't know, I am 49. I am a new empty nester and I work full time. I'm a nurse and I open up dialysis clinics all over the world. So, well, all over the United States, the Western half, but I cover like from Alaska down to Hawaii, all the way over to Louisiana. I even have like part of Wisconsin. I mean, I cover a huge territory. So sometimes I travel and do that, but you know, I'm like, I guess you could say an old hat at that. So what do you do with the rest of your life when you're so used to raising kids and you're so used to every minute is occupied, right? And you find yourself with spare time and you think it's good at first, but then <laughs> then you don't know who you are. There's no baseball games to go to. There's no football games to rush to after work. Um, nobody's home anymore. Hey, Miss Nona Grace. So I, I decided to try YouTube and it has been... It has helped me with depression. I get up in the morning, and I wasn't depressed before that happened. I'm not a depressed kind of person, but, you know, life had changed big time, and I wasn't sure what to do with myself. And so I discovered YouTube, and I know that my first videos were terrible. Miss Nona Grace, I think they're getting a little bit better. Flawed and Fabulous, would you say that they're getting a little bit better? I'm learning. You know, I'm learning YouTube. I'm learning about the tools. And I get up in the morning and I'm excited and I'm, I can't wait for somebody to go live so that I can like talk to them and meet all these wonderful new people. And just the fact that all of you hopped in is very, very exciting. So maybe you guys can meet each other. Um, Flawed and Fabulous is another makeup person. And I know you guys don't like the makeup stuff. I appreciate that you support me because I'm finding that maybe I wouldn't if I was a guy and watching a makeup channel. But I'm finding that by going to gaming channels, going to um, history channels, going to some of these mukbang channels that I'm learning a lot about different cultures and meeting different people and learning about places that I'd never get to go to. I'm going to have to catch you too, Casper. I'm, I'm loving the lives because I like all the people that that show up and all the talking that you do. So, Flawed and Fabulous, if you're not getting in lives, this has been the key to my growth. I mean, I am almost at a 1,000. I've only been on YouTube two months. I mean, I think that that is great. And so it's been from all of these friends. Jesse James, I mean, you know you can't possibly enjoy makeup, but you come and support me. And when I... I see that my heart like is so full. I don't want you guys to think that I take any of that for granted because I don't. When I get so happy and you would think that like I'm a kid at Christmas, 
but I'm truly, truly happy when I see that. Hey, Joseph. Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah, I don't have, I have a Twitter account that I just started because I'm really, really new to all this. And any tips that you guys have for me, I would welcome them. But I don't want this one to be about me. I want this. I'm hoping that at the end of this live chat, my goal is that you guys have all made connections. And if you have all done that and grown your channels, then I'll feel like this was successful. I've done well. I've had my channel for nine years. I'm still at 512. Really, Casper? Well, let me help you. Tell me how I can help you. I've already gotten, I don't know what number I'm at right now. Let's see. I'm at, I'm at 858 subscribers. So, I guess when I first started, I thought I wouldn't have any. I really, I guess my, I have low confidence. I mean, y'all see me. I'm not one of these glamorous girls, right? Like, I'm not saying I'm disgusting or anything. <laughs> I'm a normal person. I'm a normal girl. I'm not one of the beautiful girls. I'm not really skilled at makeup. Um, I am not, I'm just your everyday girl. Um, a whole bunch of different things. And I also wanted to do some lives just to show that I'm not just about makeup. Like, I'm not real superficial. Hey, Pretty Over 50, we're doing a collab together. I've already started working on it. You're going to be my first collab, and I am so excited. When Lisa said that I could do it, too, I was like, really, really? Are you serious? I guess um, I was that kid who ate lunch alone a lot of the times, if you know what I mean. I was kind of the quiet one the nerd one, the one whose mom and dad didn't have a lot of money, so my clothes weren't, you know, cool. And and as an adult, you know, I've been blessed to do better by being um, a nurse and having good jobs and good income. But I haven't gone crazy. And I don't want to think that just because I love makeup and it makes me happy to like to play in the colors and to do girly stuff, there's a story behind that because I have, I grew up with three brothers. And if I wanted to play, basically, I had to play with their friends because there was no girls around. And so I had to learn how to play football and I had to learn how to do all these things. Y'all can see my crooked football finger. This is from catching a football and breaking my finger. <laughs> so I had to try to be better than them to get included. And so I did and um, kind of got a little tomboyish. I love football, love sports, love four wheeling, hunting, all that kind of stuff. And so I guess I just never, you know, when I got into makeup and started, hey, Marcos, you came to my live. I have famous people on here. I am so excited. So um, I just really started liking makeup because I was so used to doing the boy stuff, but I've never been really good at it. So when you come to my channel for makeup, it's not really for a makeup tutorial. Hey, Rhonda, it's for testing products. Um, so all of you, can you look up above you and look below you and try to go ahead and so can't say that word and show each other some love and do it right. So what we want to do is we want to grab the person, um, save their information. So after the live or if you're working on your laptop and you can do both at one time, you can actually go in and view their video, watch a video, make a comment, give a thumbs up. That make, makes such a difference. And sometimes, you know, content creators know, but sometimes the average viewer doesn't know that that helps us. So um, I'm glad you think I'm doing um, well, Casper. I am trying really hard. Flood and fabulous, you got Casper, that is great. So you guys are helping each other. No, no, I didn't go to the shameless shout outs. Um, I'd want to know more about that. Pretty over 50. I realized I don't think I have you for some reason, but I'm going to get you tonight because we, um, we all have to stick together. And I guess that is what's turning out to be my favorite thing about YouTube is that everybody does stick together. Like I haven't met most of you all, but there are some of you that I feel like are becoming real friends. Like we're starting to learn about each other's lives. Flawed and fabulous. I mean, we kind of talk. 
I talk to Lisa Marie Beauty every single day. I'm, I met her through a live or through somebody's video. Um, I didn't know her before. And now, like, I'm planning to go and see her. And you just can't. You just can't underestimate, I guess, the power of this channel and what we what we can do. I've had five thumbs up, y'all, on my first live, and nine people came into my chat. I am so excited. I don't know how. Hey, Starface Organics. Oh, my gosh. This is so exciting. Yes, Lisa is wonderful. Like, we are really becoming friends. Um, I don't know what I do without her. Like, we encourage each other every day. And she'll tell me, girl, you got to change that thumbnail. That looks terrible. You got to re. Just wait till I get trolls. I think, Casper, I'll be happy even with trolls. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just so excited that I'm really, really doing this. Um, I think I was embarrassed to mention it to like my family and my coworkers and things because, and my friends because I figured they might think it was dumb. Because how can a country girl? who grew up with brothers and had three boys and has no makeup skills to speak of to a beauty channel. I mean, that's kind of ironic, right? But I can tell if a product is good or not, and I can show you guys if it's working. And the skincare, like, I'm learning all about skincare. Yes, yeah, my first one, Annie. So, um, and see, I'm knowing these people, and I'm getting to make friends, and the guys, too, Jesse. And Casper and all of you who are like still supporting me, even though I have a makeup channel, to me, like my heart is just from somebody, I guess, who grew up without enough love. I am sure getting it now. And it took me to almost 50 to get to the stage where I'm getting my confidence. And I guess I am. Hey, Lisa, I'm trying my first live. Thank you for coming. I'm nervous. Obviously, I'm rambling a little bit. I'm sweating. <laughs> But I am excited. Marcos wears makeup every day now, right, Marcos, now that you have learned how to put it on from me, right? So, um, Lisa, I am so glad you're here. That is so awesome. I did my collab with you today. All I have to do is edit it. Stephen M. Lee, tell him I said hello, too. I fixed up Steve and Emily back in the day. Steve and Emily. Steve and Rhonda, my friend Rhonda, who's on here, back in the day, and they are still married today. How long has that been, Rhonda? How many years? We were, I was in, I was in college. I was in nursing school. And my husband now, yep, they've been married 27 years, and um, I introduced them. So, um, awesome awesome people so how do i do that casper can you help me out with that can i make you a moderator and marco so y'all can help me um add moderator okay casper are you okay for being a moderator do you mind okay and what about marco's can i make you one That way, um, until I I learn, I'm going to make a couple of y'all one. And it's um, to help me put people in timeout or to get rid of trolls while I'm trying to, to look at all of you. Just keep in mind, hey, Murad came too. I am so excited, y'all. I feel like I have arrived. I have famous people in my chat. So you guys make sure that you do the right thing and hopefully at the end of this you can say, oh, well, this chat wasn't too bad. Look at all the new friends that I've made and they're all visiting my house. That was a great idea, Casper. I didn't think of that. I think I'm actually sweating. I haven't been this nervous in a long time. <laughs> But yet, I am so, oh, thank you. I am so happy. So, YouTube has, YouTube has changed my life. Oh, thank you. 
You know what I used today? I know Marcos will be familiar with this now that I'm getting him into makeup. This is an Ibby palette. So um, Ibby palettes are a cheaper brand of makeup. And I had talked about them as being so pretty for being so affordable. Hey, Jesse James, you are so awesome. He stops by and gives me a heart on my comments. Hey, Soxy. Oh, look at this, y'all. I'm really, I have 10 thumbs. And Vanessa. <laughs> y'all have made my night. So I'm sitting here tonight and the Saints won, which is my team. And I, I know pretty over 50. Nobody's heard of it. And that's the thing. It is, it is, it came in Ipsy boxes and I kept getting them. And they would come in these little, you know, palettes about, you know, silver dollar size with three colors in it and they actually are beautiful um inexpensive colors and and they rival to me any other brand oh and like the button y'all are helping me moderators ah, this is so awesome me and marcos had talked about whether i should do a live or not and we thought maybe i should wait till i got to a thousand because nobody might not come. Hey, Lori, this is my first live. I'm just trying it because I've been participating in a lot of lives and they have been, as Murad says, awesome, awesome. How do you like that, Murad? I picked up your, um, your term. I even texted my son today and I told him awesome, awesome because he got, he, um, he got a deer today. So, um, y'all are picking each other up, I hope. So that means making each other, um, going to each other's house and showing some love. There are some people on here that might not know the lingo yet. But that and watching the video and trying to watch it for as long as you can, hitting the thumbs up and leaving a genuine comment. Rhonda, this is the first YouTube like that uh, live that you've seen. Yes, there's like some little terms that get us in trouble for spam like you can't put more than three emojis i think marco said oh thank you pretty over 50. at first i wasn't sure if we wanted to share it with anybody because i didn't know if nobody would be here but myself <laughs> but this is amazing Nona Grace is so sweet. She has a channel and she does a lot. Uh, she she um, does videos almost every day and she's a little shy of the camera, but she is getting used to her fear with that. Y'all have to hush. And she is, they need to go out, but I'm scared that if I go bring them out, y'all are going to leave and nobody else is here to let them out. Marcos, can you entertain people in Murad just for a minute? I'm going to run really quick and let them out. I don't want y'all to leave me. Not my first one. Don't leave. I'm coming back. Okay, come on. Let's go out. Let's go out. Let's go out. Come back. Come back. Come back. How do y'all like that? I dressed up for y'all with a sweater and I have pajamas on the bottom. That just tells y'all a little bit about the fact that I am a true country girl. <laughs> we can be all kinds of things. Your dogs are really interested in what's going on. These, I call them my dogs. They're actually started out as my son's dogs, but y'all know how that goes. And I love them now. And they love me, and they are loyal. You love the pajamas? I call them warmies because I'm always cold. So when y'all see me in videos, now in your mind, you can always be thinking, she doesn't have pants on. She has pajama bottoms on. <laughs> she just put the shirt on so we couldn't tell. And I want a coffee so bad at McDonald's that I wear these pajama pants right to the McDonald's to get a coffee. I'm out of my um, my coffee to make in my coffee maker, and I would have a headache by the end of the day. 
Lori, I think it would be easier if they were lap dogs, but because they are those big old labs, my goodness, but, but they're so loyal. They just want to, they want to be by my feet all the time. Hey, Shadrach came too. Oh my goodness, y'all are too great. James MMA, welcome. Thank you so much for coming to my first live. Gigi, thank you. And Vanessa is so sweet. She's trying to help me get organized. Lisa, I bought four of these coffees. My son saw me come in and he's like, what are you going to do with all those coffees? And I'm like, I'm going to drink them. I can drink coffee all the way till I go to bed and it just doesn't even affect me. So guys, what I'm finding out about these lives is, is a different kind of live because in the mature beauty community, which is my main community, when we do lives, we're doing some kind of tutorial where we're putting on makeup or something like that. But on these lives, y'all, it's simply to grow, network, make connections to, um, you know, the S word to each other, show some love and to go see their videos and to give them a like and to stay connected is the most important part because it doesn't take really like I spend an hour a day just going through any of you guys that pop up and you see sometimes it takes me a little while to get to you. But, you know, if you try that at least a couple times a week, you're going to get over to that person. You wouldn't be able to sleep, Lisa. I started drinking coffee in nursing school when I was poor. <laughs> and I would go to nursing school without money in my pocket a lot of times and I'd be at clinicals. And I didn't have money to eat, and I was skinny as a size zero. And um, I, I discovered that the coffee at the hospital was free. So I learned how to like coffee, and I drink it over and over and over again all day long. My nursing specialty right now is dialysis. So my favorite has been hospice and oncology. But I have gotten some promotions through the years. And now I am um, at an executive level within my company. And so my job is very serious. That's another reason that I'm enjoying YouTube. Because all my life I have chased those promotions and chased those career moves so that I could, you know, take care of my family. But now, you know, they're taking care of themselves. So maybe I'll end up getting back to floor nursing, which I really miss. But... I um, make sure that people who work for me, that we get these dialysis clinics open on time. I work with the construction workers and it can be hard to manage your emotions. But you know what? When I was doing hospice, I felt like if I didn't get a little teary or emotional, then I was in the wrong field. You know, when I, when I stop feeling when somebody else is going through something like that, then, then something's wrong. So, I mean, it would be inappropriate if I would get too sad. And what I found was that I could not take care of dying children. I could not do hospice with sick children because I would, I would carry that with me. But with adults, it was a little bit different. So, um, it's, I need to be fulfilled. I guess that has been something my whole life is that I always felt like I had something to prove, like to become successful, to make something of myself. Like not many people thought that I would. And so I would always be competitive and want to make it in whatever I did. And just seeing you guys, I have 17 thumbs up. I just cannot even believe it. You guys are so awesome. What can I do for you? So I don't mind getting on playlist rotations. Yeah, my neighbors are hanging out. Lisa laughs at my background because this guy <laughs> is always standing outside. <laughs> I started looking at backgrounds today. Lisa, I found one that I really liked. It's kind of like a pinky bright background, but it was $85. I was like, oh my gosh, that's like a lot. Um, so... I'm looking for a different background that's maybe not so busy. I just want to, I want to do it right. I'm not sure, you know, I'm still learning what I need. But I just took a chance on this. It said that I cannot do live on my phone or a, a camera until I get to a thousand. But I mean, 
I've only got like a hundred and less than 150 to go. So maybe I'll get there and it'll be better and I won't keep freezing. So you had to leave hospice because you couldn't leave work at home. Yeah, that does happen. So Shadrach says, how are you at Marcos? Vanessa, believe it, girl. Believe it, believe it. I'm trying to believe it. This is really, really happening. You guys are, like, so amazing. Like, I just feel like I've been welcomed into your lives. And when we get on these live streams, we share things. We spend time together. Yesterday, I was on um, a live. So, I, I don't know if you guys have ever checked out Think Dragon or um, Z um, Trucking. Both of those um, have welcomed me into their families, and I spend a lot of time on those chats. And Murad knows that I, I pop into his chats on a regular basis. If I see them, I try to get into them because um, it's my way of meeting so many people. Hey, Naomi. Oh, thank you so much. I can't wait till I have a community tab. I didn't think that that would ever happen I really just thought, you know, like after a few months that probably nobody would come or nobody would comment. And I have just been so pleasantly surprised. And not to sound like a charity case or anything, because I have a good life, but I needed that. I was lost for a little while. Um, I lost my dad three years ago, and that was really hard. And then my mom... Um, got breast cancer a year after he died. So I thought I was going to lose her too. And then I lost one of my cousins at the age of 39. And my uncle, like all in three years, it was just um, a lot. And then my boys leaving home. And I just, I just didn't know who I was. I was just like, who am I without having all these responsibilities and roles? And so YouTube has given me new purpose and it's given me new friends. So, um, awesome, awesome. Yes, that is my new word. Murad, do you have a copyright on that? Awesome, awesome. Can I, can I say that? I'm going to have to show you, send you a screenshot of my, um, my phone where I sent that out to my son today. It's stuck. And now I'm saying it all the time. Y'all, Lori. Abercrombie is great too. Lori is um, a faithful subscriber on my channel. She is beautiful and she is she is encouraging and she is faithful and loyal. But she also will tell me like it is, like she'll give me suggestions or she'll tell me if I'm wrong. And that's the kind of friends you want, right? You want real friends. I want to make genuine friends, the friends that care enough about you to tell you, like, if something's not right or if you should make a change. Yes, Lisa, it is a fun time to spend, um, a fun way to spend time at the airport gate. I spend a lot of time at airport gates with my job. Casper, same to me, too. I think the best help that I can use right now is watch hours. Because I think I'm going to hit my subscriber number way before I hit my hour number. Oh, I said the S word. Hopefully, since I'm not monetized yet, it won't matter. Um, so I do I do want to hit that goal. StreamYard? Okay. I'm going to try to set that up after um, the stream tonight. But I think even more than monetization or money i mean i want to hit that goal because right that's the goal that kind of tells me you have arrived right you have you have made it you have done it but more than that i just want people to come to my channel and connect i just want to have friends and meet guys and girls that have similar interests or different interests because i'm learning about every kind of subject under the sun i wish i could think of the guy anybody on here know the guy who does the um does the chats, the real history, the real history talks. He like, I like history. So he's amazing to me. And he only has like 350 of the S words <laughs> followers, people who love him. So I think, oh, his information is so much more interesting than mine. Hey, Michael Allen, welcome, welcome. 
Thank y'all for whoever shared this chat. I have 20 thumbs up on my first live. This is incredible. Y'all are wonderful. Mystery Steamboat. I like to think I'm good with accents, but I can't place yours. What state of America are you in? I don't have an accent. I'm from South Louisiana. I live literally on the bayou in a little town called Bayou Gosh. That would be where I end up living, right? That means left bayou, right? Like the wrong side of the bayou. Story of my life. We, um, we wear shrimp boots, shrimp boots for fun, and a lot of times you'll find us at the local grocery store in shrimp boots and crabbing clothes because people here are either big time rich and have bought up the land and run the tour boat guides and the, what do you call them, the airboat tours and all those things, or they're fishers and crabbers and make their living that way. So it's kind of like a mixed bag. StreamYard is a streaming platform that allows you to stream onto YouTube and it allows guests to be invited to come into the stream and chat live with you. Like Skype. Okay, Casper, I have to do that tonight because I think that would take a little pressure off. I I want to keep doing these, um, but maybe having some people come up. Um Michael Allen, I'm gonna send a moderator after you. I'm gonna to have to take mean Mona out the box. What do you mean you like feet? <laughs> um, oh, you're awesome. That's much better, much better. Okay, you have been redeemed. It would be in this chat room, it would be awesome, awesome though. I um I may do that. Maybe you can. My email is in my description of my videos. Maybe you could email me and I could um, get with you, and we could um we could see if you have a little time to talk me through that. I'm teasing. I'm teasing. If you're being funny, that will certainly be all right. I can take a joke. Um, I just don't want to do anything wrong to um, mess up my live where they kick me off of YouTube or anything. And on Marcos' first live, I said I did something wrong. He had to fuss me in a nice way. I don't know what I did. I forgot. But he had to tell me, no, you can't do that. Oh, Lori, that's beautiful. That is why I loved hospice, where people would say that it's so sad, but there were so many beautiful things that happened. No, Michael, um, who, who are you talking about? Are they single? I don't know if we have, I don't know who's single in the chat. Annie, are you single? Oh, I'm not single. I've been married and I'm old. <laughs> Okay, don't buy the pro version. Okay. So Annie is single. We do have a single lady in the house. And I love fixing up people. So, so Vanessa, you're having fun? So are you snapping people up? Are you like showing them some love, like going over to their house and knocking on their door and pushing all the right bells and whistles yes my lives will include everything that you can think about okay Lori is single also so we may have a matchmaking session so trucker z is single i think and i think i don't know if think dragon is single but they're both really nice Yeah, um, Louisiana is, Louisiana is an okay state. I don't know how we describe it. We're probably the lowest um, ranked on everything except for Mississippi. <laughs> but mixed in with that, there are some really nice, wonderful people. You know, you kind of sometimes stay where you're, 
where you're born. Like, you know, a lot of us were born in the USA and we ended up here and I was born in Louisiana and I ended up here, you know, my parents were here and then I went to school here. So then I got a job here. Then I got a husband here. And then until we retire, you know, we're probably, we're probably going to ride it out here. We do hunt and fish. So we spend time in um, Illinois and I'm hoping to be traveling with Lisa sometime. She has some timeshares in different places. And when she doesn't have people going with her, I'm hoping that sometimes I can go. And I'm going to be biting Lisa on some of my trips that I do for work because she, um, her husband works for the airline and she gets to travel for free. So that means she could come to me on some of my trips. You coming for venison? We have a freezer full right now. So Seth got one. My youngest is Seth. He is 20. He um, just killed one in Illinois um, this morning, and it is, I think, a 10-point, and um, it looks like a huge deer. That deer was rutting. That neck was real big, swollen with all those glands, chasing those does. Little Makeup Channel, hello, hello. I cannot believe all of you have come for me. Guys, if I get one more thumb, I will have 20 thumbs. I know I probably sound like I am like five, but I'm like so excited. Um, Lori, it's definitely a spiritual experience. I always said that if you go into hospice and you don't believe, I don't know how you could leave working in hospice without, without having a belief. It is, um, there were so many spiritual moments, too many things that could not possibly be explained any other way. Um, we'll have to share some of those stories sometimes. Oh, thank you. Lori, we need to make you a moderator too. I think you're a strong woman and you definitely can do it. Um, some of the other people with wrenches can show y'all how to use the wrenches. Marcos took my wrench away, but I'm learning how to use, um, wrenches now. I have 21. <laughs> I wonder why, Lori. I just, um, I think I like the lives. I mean, I won't be able to do them a lot, but I think that maybe on the weekends, um, especially during hunting season when I'm all by myself, that maybe I'll do one in the evenings. Well, you have to have a wrench. I'll give everyone a wrench because I'm just so happy that everybody came. You guys have made my night. And... I think you can use that wrench. What you can do is you can hover over the person's face or if you're on the computer, you can hover over the dots and you can put them in time out if they do something wrong and if they are really like really over the line obnoxious, then you can actually, I think, um, get them out or hide their comments or something like that. So, Lori, I think you have um, a lot to um, to share with us also. Have you ever thought about doing a channel? So, are, are y'all um, going to each other's houses and showing the love? And pressing all the right buttons. No way. No way, Marcos. I can't be that. <gasps> Think Dragon is in the house. Think Dragon, you were my first inspiration to do a live. He was nice to me from moment one. Marcos was nice to me. Jesse James, I have made it, y'all. I am going to get a tiara. I am going to have to take a bow. I am so excited. I have 22 thumbs. I thought nobody was going to come for sure. <laughs>
Yes, Lori, I think you should give it a go. We will support you. Jesse James, that's awesome. It's awesome. I think Murad left us. I'm probably too boring as a, a chat host. So when I could get that little feature um, where I can bring people up, that will probably be better. I'm probably not that interesting. I think that would be really good, Lori. You could collab with me. I actually do feel like, you know, my skincare is, is probably the best. Well, thank you, Mystery. Mystery Steamboat, guys, if you have not picked him up, he does um, a lot of really cool editing. I would love to learn how to do that. So he um, he, he does a lot of sing-alongs, so kind of like karaoke. Um, I'll put his, his channel on, and I'll find myself, you know, moving to the beat while he's, um, he's singing his, his little sing-along. And then he has this little root. Um, it's probably a character that everybody else knows of, and I just don't know about it. But it, um, it dances, and he's, like, just got the coolest, like, um, what do you call that, um, effects in his videos that are, I haven't learned how to do yet. So y'all should check him out. You do, Lori. If I can do it, anybody in this whole world can do it. Because I've been afraid of everything my whole life. I have lived afraid and I'm almost 50 years old and I have wasted so much of my life. And guess what? I'm not wasting any more of it. Y'all can see that I finally did a little trailer for my channel. It's um, less than two minutes. And it just kind of tells uh, about my channel. I felt like I wanted to put a disclaimer because I'm going to all these wonderful channels and I'm seeing all of these people who have content that is out of this world, content that is uplifting, motivation, motivational, spiritual, you know, really giving tips that are helping change people's lives. And I'm telling them about makeup products that work. And it makes me feel so shallow. And I guess I just wanted people to know that that is just a little piece of me, right? That is... That is the, the part that I found to talk about on YouTube that might be interesting to other people, but that is not all that I am, that I'm more than that. Hey, Joyce, thank you so much for coming. I'm so excited to have you. Hi, Kimberly and everybody. I am doing so great. This is my first live, and I'm very excited to have you all. I'm hoping that you all can meet and greet each other, but do it the right way. Um, I want this to be a live. Every live that I give, I'm probably going to try to do once, one a week as long as I can get this kind of participation and people don't stop being excited by my videos and think they're boring. This might be interesting for all the gentlemen friends that I've made on here more than makeup videos. So um, if you would be interested in joining my family, Joyce, I'd love to have you. I just did a new trailer, kind of what my channel is about. I am 49. I'm from South Louisiana. I am pretty much a country girl and pretty much simple, um, not fancy, but I do like girly stuff. And um, I also like to read and I like to learn. I'm kind of a nerd. I guess my life is not that interesting. I work a lot. I raise my kids. I listen to podcasts and I read books and I am probably a little bit of an introvert. And so being with people this way is easier for me than being like in a big crowd of people. If I'm one on one, obviously I can talk your head off as I'm doing now. But if we are like in a big group, I kind of get intimidated and anxiety and um, I'm not real comfortable in a big group. My favorite podcast, if you saw my podcast channel so it has a little bit of everything i like um true crime i listen to southern fried true crime i listen to all of the true crime podcasts i'm really fascinated with the story of the west memphis three and also the zodiac um killer i love um true crime i also love documentaries so i watch podcasts on pbs frontline 
Isn't that exciting? I don't know, just couldn't wait to hear about that. Um, history. Yes, I like all things girly, which I didn't know, Kimberly, and because raised with, with three brothers and having three boys and having a very blue collar husband who hunts and fishes and all that, I guess, um, like my house looks like a taxidermy shop for sure. Uh, if you walked around in my living room, all you're going to see is, bye, be safe, Lisa, stay in touch. Um, all you're going to see is eyes looking at you. And I'm an animal lover. So, um, but my husband is a conservationist. He would not kill anything that he wouldn't eat. And he does clean kills. And we donate a lot of food to families who are around there who really don't have anything. Um, I'm so glad you guys got to meet Lisa. She's been um, really special on Facebook. And she's trying to grow her channel too. Um, she, she's much more professional than I am. She's much more polished. She's a fancier lady than I am. And I think that you guys would really like her. Where I say um too much, she doesn't. Where my hair is never fixed right, hers is always fixed beautiful. Where my makeup is mm, meh, hers is like point on. Yes, aren't they good, Vanessa? I aspire to be more like her. And I am very glad that I'm getting to know all of you. Really? Yeah, too many are starving. And that's what my husband says. Like, he tells me, you know, it's necessary that they, I guess, eliminate some. They're not wasting them. They're providing... They're providing food, and it's not just for, it's not for sport. Um, so we make sure that, he said, thinning the herds is something that they have to do anyway, and it's better than them starving. At least that's his story, and he's sticking to it. Think Dragon, thank you so much. I can't do it like you. Think Dragon gets on there, and he's just like, He's belting it out. I was worried about him yesterday because he's so animated that I thought maybe he didn't feel good yesterday, but I think he was just being normal. The first time, were you nervous? It's that fear of rejection. I think that I live with constantly that People won't like me. You know, I get the thumbs down on every video. Like, as soon as I start, somebody's going to put a thumbs down or two thumbs down. And I'm thinking, I know my videos probably aren't that great, but can't you just don't like mine <laughs> instead of, you know, this just happened. I told Lisa about this. So <laughs> I went to a um, live streams and I saw it pop up on my phone or on my computer. So I went and I looked at them. And I thought, oh, these poor people. I thought I was going to do bad, but they're not even talking. Like, they have no content whatsoever. Like, they're, they're not going to make it. So, like, I hopped off a couple of them. By the time I was on my third one, I realized what was, what was going on. I felt so dumb. I'm like, oh, like, this is a thing. <laughs> I'm so nerdy. This is a thing. Like, they have lives where you just talk or you just get people to grow and network. So, hi, Anna. Think Dragon Pretty Over 50 is wonderful. She has invited me to do my first collab with um, Lisa Monique Beauty. And so we're going to be doing a live coming up pretty soon. I've got to start working on that because it's about um, being glamorous, which Pretty Over 50, that is a little bit of a struggle for me. We're going to... I'm the girl who's going to, I'm going to go to the nines, right? I'm going to have a beautiful gown. I'm going to have the makeup on. I'm going to go get my hair fixed. I'm going to get my nails done. And then by the time I get to whatever the event is, I'll have a run in my hose, a broken nail. My hair will be sticking up somewhere. So I can never like pull it off for the whole night. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. And I dress up for my lives for y'all because I wanted y'all to see me at my best wearing my finest Harry Potter sweater. 
and then my favorite pajama pants. So um, I'm fancy smancy. Hi, Maloney Money Mindset. Thank you so much for coming. I'm so excited. I came from Naomi Slots. Thank you, Naomi, for sending me some people. Y'all are making my first live a success. We are already at 24 thumbs. 25 thumbs. I have 25 thumbs. And 26. And I didn't think I'd get any. Oh, thank you. Can I give you a wrench? He gave me. Let's see. Let me find him in here. So is everybody picking up everybody? I have my, my microphone should, I, I got a microphone and it's here, but I, I'm so dumb that I didn't realize that it couldn't work with my phone. It's supposed to be able to work with my computer, but I couldn't get it to work. So I have another one coming in on Monday. So hopefully people won't be complaining that they can't hear me. Oh. Annie, is that me that you're talking about? Who are you talking about? I can't be fake. I wish I could. Like sometimes it would help me in my job because how can I say this without sounding like I'm bragging? I'm not bragging, but, but I'm pretty smart as far as knowing things, knowledge things, because I like to read and because I did well in school and probably because I didn't have a lot of friends, so I studied a lot like a nerd. And so my leadership qualities and all of that like helped me really grow in my company. And I'm pretty high up, but there's a disconnect between me and them because they are so, they're so polished and most of them come, you know, with a lot of money or a more polished look. And they, more, most of them are from the north and so they don't have an accent. You know, you can put me up next to somebody from Boston and there's just no comparing us. Like I just always come across as that, that country girl just uh, can't quite pull off that completely polished look. So I guess, you know, that that's what I said in my new trailer that I did is that we can be authentic and we can be many things. We don't have to be just one thing. We can be a lot of different things. And that what I'm finding, I think, is that what everybody wants is that we want everybody to know that we're not perfect and know who we really are and like us anyway. And when that happens, that is such a gift. And when you can give that gift to somebody else, you are really doing something special. If you can just accept them for who they are and, and know that, you know, no, they're not perfect, but they're good things in everybody. And you can just give that unconditional acceptance. That is such a kindness. Mystery Steamboat, 12, it's 23.33 p.m. UK time. Wow. It's 5.43 p.m. where I'm at. So we have two Kimberly M's. Thank you, Marcos. That that's important to me. And so I'm I'm thinking why I changed my channel from skin dippity to about face. And I know it's not good to change, but I figured it was better to change while I was small. Maybe I'll always be small, but at least about face kind of has dual meanings. So for me it was kind of about face, like about my skin cancer and the fact that, you know, this side of my face is you know, kind of messed up and maybe that's kind of ironic with me doing a beauty channel. But I just want to say that, you know, we can we can put our best face forward even if that face is not perfect. And we can we can show people that I guess you're more than you know, beauty is more than just skin deep and that is also how you act and how you treat people. And so I think I'm gonna do like one skincare thing a week and one beauty thing a week. And then I think that I'm going to do one thing a week that is kind of for everybody. So I want to ask you guys before you get tired of me and leave. I want to ask what do you think, especially content creators, what do you guys think about a, a 
Vlogmas Challenge. So I was, we did a dragon raid last night, and we raided somebody's channel. And when we went to their channel, that's what they were talking about. So they, they recommended that we do a tag, and we do Vlogmas, that we get on, and we do some kind of little video clip, live vlog, every night from December 1st through the end of December. And I know that would take a lot of time, but oh my last comments, you will grow with time. Yes, I think the name is more authentic. And so what do you guys think about the vlogmas where we get on and we do not a long video because during Christmas everybody's gonna be really, really busy. And so I thought Maybe I could do, you know, we could do the glam look. We can do some holiday looks, something to do with, you know, what to wear, some some items to wear while you're going to holiday parties. But maybe something a little deeper than that. So maybe like I could read a read about the the birth of Jesus. So even if people are not Christian, right? Some people still believe that Jesus was a real person, even if, if they don't think he was a child of God, and that maybe. You think I had stress? I was thinking maybe just like two or three minutes of reading the story of the Christ child just each night. Yeah, Vlogmas is supposed to be a daily thing. And, I, you know, I still have to work full time. Like, I can't quit that job. My husband would kill me <laughs> because I do pretty well. And we're not quite ready for that income to go. But... I want to be more fulfilled as a person. And so YouTube is helping me do that. But sometimes I feel like the makeup is shallow. Yeah, maybe 12 days of Christmas. Yeah, that might be more reasonable. Hmm. Think Dragon, what do you think of that? 12 days. I've been pretty consistent. I think I'm pretty committed. Um, I think I could do 12 days. And and that's what I figured I'd mix in the makeup too. But because it's, you know, it's a, a magical season for so many people. I try to be inclusive. Um, just so you guys know, I have my beliefs and I might talk about them. But I don't push them on anyone else like I am very accepting of all people probably one of the most accepting people that you will meet like my kids laugh about it all the time like you know it doesn't matter if somebody's standing behind you with every kind of face piercing in the world you know multicolored hair sticking up somebody I'm not somebody we see that a lot these days but I'm talking too extreme and they will just see me turn around and talk to them like I talk to my grandma and my mom like I don't see the differences in people, I see the similarities. We all have commonalities. Oh, thank you, Lori. I guess I really like it. And I think, like I said, it comes from having growing up with the brothers where makeup, you know, wasn't a good thing. I was more of a tomboy to fit in. And then I had three boys and I married a blue collar guy. And then all of a sudden one day I just, you know, I started, I guess, getting some makeup and fooling with it. And I really liked the pretty colors and I really liked the pink things. And I like girly things. You know, I live in a house of boys. You know, we even have a boy dog and a boy cat. It's just like, I like, I like pink and I like girly things. And so, um, yeah, I like the makeup. For an aging woman, it's incredibly important to take care of your skin and learn how to manage makeup with changing skin. Yes. And I think that is one of the videos that I want to do. The next video I'm going to do is a collaboration with, um, that'll be on Tuesday. And that's going to be with Lisa Marie, uh, uh, Lisa Marie, Lisa, I'm thinking of the Presley girl, Lisa Monique Beauty. We're going to do, um, you know, Lux, Lux things. Um, Three lux things that are worth the money and three lux things that are just hogwash and not worth your money. And then I'm doing the collab with Pretty Over 50. 
then I was thinking about doing how to prep your face for makeup. Because um, my son's girlfriend was saying that she's learned a lot from my videos and she's only 25. And she said, you know, there are just things about skincare and makeup that she just did not know. Papa Bear, thank you. Papa Bear has been stopping by too. Papa Bear, I hope you checked out those links for your nieces. Those are on QVC. They are very affordable and they are very nice palettes. It's $25 for three little palettes. And you can also get the six easy pays for like $4.19, uh, I think, a month until they're paid off. And I think that those would be a better value and that they would like them more than the beauty book that I showed. Hey, Lala Crazy. Yes, Vanessa White Randomness said, this YouTube stuff is quite a journey. We come in expecting one thing and get something so different. Thank goodness for other creator, creators, supportive creators. Yes, we're all still trying to figure it out. And I'm looking to the ones who've made it and trying to learn from them. And I can learn from them and learn tricks from them and tips. However, you know, I can't change who I am. I'm good, Lala Crazy. I am so excited to be doing my first live. 29 likes. I, I might hit 30 likes. I am so thrilled. This has become um, so exciting. Thank you, Think Dragon. Thank you for coming. I appreciate that. I just want to repeat that the Skin Beautiful RX is having a 30% off sale that ends tonight. It's all medical grade. And the owner, Leah Parks, is on Facebook and will answer any questions. I'm going to check that out, Lori. I, I like medical grade skincare, And that's one of the things that I talked about in, in the video that's going to upload on Tuesday. Is that I would much rather spend a lot more on medical grade skincare than on on products but medical grade skincare that's going to work i had brought some bought something from chanel that was an eye cream that cost a lot of money and had a lot of claims and it didn't do anything my youtube journey is having fun the day that stops is the day i stop vlogging mr steamboat i love your channel and you can see i'm a regular stopper by the code is bf30 okay you guys um, who are interested in skincare drop that down Lori. i'm going to check that out tonight And it distracts me on the days I'm having bad disability days. It does. It. I look forward to it every day. And when people comment, Lori has been commenting. Um, Annie has been commenting. Papa Bear has been commenting. Like the Vanessa White randomness. I like her videos and she comments. And we learn different things. Like I learn different things from each channel. So, um, you know, that's that's been awesome. You get your eye cream from Lee, the IS Clinical. I have um, Mystery Steamboat, um, the, the Mystery Steamboat that's in the stream. Or are you talking to him? I saw you had posted about the IS. Oh, okay. So are, are you a nurse or, or a sitter, Miss Joyce? Oh, he's got MS. Mystery Steamboat, I'm a nurse by trade. So, yeah, I know that's a tough journey. I admire you for pushing, for pushing through and, and doing your, doing your YouTube. And you bring so much joy to others through your YouTube, your, your YouTube channel. Because I know that my spirits pick up when I go on your, your channel. 
Well, you guys are all brave. Vanessa, looking at you go and do all this organization. I'm not an organized person, so I really try to learn from your channels and um, try to ch shop better and make my money go further. But really what I try to get from your channel is better organization. I'm going to be praying for both of you guys. My heart is so touched tonight. Be well, Papa Bear. Thank you so very much. I appreciate all of you coming in. I know that I've kept you all a long time. We've been on for an hour. I will end the live. And I'm wondering, um, my heart is bursting too. I am, I am just... I am so happy. Thank you, Anna, so much. You guys have really, really made my whole day that this was not a failure. Well, I mean, I don't know what size is the right size to be successful, but yes, I'm getting ready to go to Vanessa. Thank you so much. All of you keep in touch. I promise I am loyal. And if you need me, my email is in the description. You can always reach out. Big hugs to all of you. Yes, go to sleep and take care of yourself. Hey, Francis, how are you? Thank you, Annie. We are doing good. We're getting ready to close up. People have been with me for a while. We've gotten them. Um, oh, thank you, Casper, so much. So I am um, going to get with you, Casper. Um, do you guys think that y'all would be interested in doing one a week? Could we do another one? Hey, Mike's Computer Tips. Hi. Thank you so much. Oh, wow. I would love to do, you know, maybe just a half an hour one or an hour one. But, yes, like, have more. Because the videos are one thing. But I think what's really, really making my heart happy is, is actually getting to know all of you. It's my favorite, favorite thing. It is You do have people send you um, PCs. That's, um, I have um, a laptop right now, but Mike does um, computer tips. You guys, if you have not picked up Mike, and he, um, he is affordable and reasonable and honest. And if you, he will actually take mail-in orders for repairs, too. Um, it's nice to support each other, Mike, like that. And I would rather do that and support a fellow content creator and um, instead of doing that. So you guys make up, um, make sure to pick everybody up before you leave. Um, Mike's computer tips. Um, Zach and Ron. Hey, thank you, Zan and Ron. Thank you so much for joining. This has been my first live and has been very exciting. Oh, thank you, Mystery Steamboat. I don't know if anybody's ever called me cool before, but I'm so excited to be cool. You guys have really, y'all have made one lady very, very happy. I can ah, see your message, Joyce. I might have missed some because this is my first one, but I'm going to go back and read them all. And I would like to do some more lives um, because this has been very fun, and you guys have all been really great and really engaged. And it's kind of exciting. And I'll have... Um, my new camera soon so that um, as soon as I hit a thousand, I can, I can do lives on my camera and have the quality be a little bit better. Thank you, Lori. You make me happy when you come on and you know so much already. And I think, you know, she should be doing this. I think that all the time. So if you decide to do it, not that you'd need my help, but me and me and, um, me and Lisa would really, really help you get started in anything that you needed. 
The Logitech C922X Pro. Okay, I'm writing that down. So my microphone comes in on on Monday or Tuesday, but that video for Tuesday has already been recorded today. And then, so I should have my microphone on by Thursday. Zan and Ron, if y'all haven't picked up everybody, go and show some love to everybody's house. Everybody show Zan and Ron some love. Watch a video, give y'all... Uh, press all the right buttons, a thumbs up, leave a genuine comment, watch the video. So thank you all so much. I am going to call it um, an evening on the live and I'm going to go um, reply back to my comments that, um, that I have for earlier and um, probably maybe Think Dragon might be doing um, a, a live tonight. So if you all did not pick, pick up Think Dragon, his lives are better than mine and wonderful. And if y'all have not picked up Casper too, y'all, pick him up because he said he does lives too. King Xenomorph. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I, what a looker. I thought you said what a look. I was like, everybody's laughing. My kid said I look like Harry Potter. <laughs> You guys are so wonderful to join. King, this is my first live, so I was trying it out. I got 32 thumbs up. I thought that was pretty good for a first time. Oh, just saying, Ron. Okay, got it. So everybody pick up Zan Ron. Show some love. Show King Xenomorph some love. Press all the right buttons. This is too cool. I've had so much fun. And Zan Ron, I don't have you, but I'm gonna go look at, um, since this is my first live, I've been a little bit um, rusty. I'm gonna make um, some more of you moderators so y'all um, can help me out in future chats. until I learn what I'm doing. Who all did I say to follow? Okay, so King Xenomorph, who's right below you, he is awesome. Hey, James MMA. Marcos Eats is awesome. Think Dragon, he is um, awesome as well. And Trucker... Z. These are all like great people and they are great. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Dan Ron. Yeah, I have I have the nervous, but um but happy at the same time. <laughs> Suzanne Ron, I'm making you oh Miss Louisiana Housewife. Hello, hello. How are you doing tonight? Yes, I saw one of her videos today and she is who made me go in and do a trailer. She has got the best trailer. It was all of her little loves in the car saying what they were doing. Hi Enos, how are you? Make sure you guys grab everybody up before the chat ends. What is name? My name is Mona. Jesse James, you're still here. Or did you come back? Oh, my name on Instagram is About Face with Mona. New on Instagram, 
Well, I've been on Instagram a while, but I haven't really figured out Instagram too good yet. So if any of you have tips on how Instagram can help my YouTube, you guys can send me an email on that. <laughs> because I'm technologically challenged. But I will get there because I am determined and I don't give up anything that I start. Hey, cutie. Yeah, my name on Instagram is the same. It's all about Face with Mona. And Twitter is also about Face with Mona. But nobody's following me on Twitter yet. Zero. Zero. <laughs> it's just me. Oh, thank you. Cutie, I didn't know what I was doing, but I figured I was just going to be brave. And if people laughed or didn't come, I was going to take the chance. Um, about face with Mona. Yep, that's it. Nope, cutie, that's just, it's just a posting. It's just up on my wall. I do have a big yard in the backyard because I live in the country. And everything is um, rural, so I, I live on an acre or a little over an acre, but um, that's just a, a, a vinyl backdrop. I'm in a little room, and the room um, is the room that my son moved out of, and it doesn't have any natural light in here, so I thought that that might make it look a little brighter. Thank you, Apal. Thank you. Thank you for the thumbs up. I have 37, you guys. I think that's pretty good for, for a first live. And I can't believe all the people who came. I am from South Louisiana. I actually live in a little town called Bayou Gosh. It is really close to the Gulf of Mexico. Bunch of hunters and fishers this is my first time doing it apollo i've never done a live thank you that makes me feel very good i'm always self-conscious about that ha <laughs> if you build it they will come huh well it looks like it i just think you guys are just great people i'm from louisiana yep the very bottom of louisiana you can tell I'm country. I know because I wear 